new, hopefully good. Uh, okay, so the unboxing. This is the Fire Emblem Limited Edition right here. Uh, it's I already opened one side. I didn't look inside. I've seen videos already, so I know what I'm going to see. Unless, like, there's a golden ticket in here, which I don't know. Um, but it's beautiful, as you can see. It's not that big. Because of the size of a face. Um, some stuff in the back. You guys might be interested to see. I don't think my camera is up to the task of providing the best quality. You can see the butler. And then this guy, the old man. Um, obviously, I will be playing Conquest, which is the what, these guys. And this is the Hoshido side. Uh, birthright. So Conquest, Nor. Hoshido, not Nor. Um, okay. I mean, I don't know who else we should wait for. I think we're ready to do this because I can't wait. You maybe can't wait, but I can't wait, and I love you guys, so I'm going to open it up. I'm also trying to open it, like, really gently, because I don't want to mess up the box. But I always end up messing the box. Okay, so we got one side. We got two sides, okay. Alright. Da -da 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 -da. I wish I had, like, epic music right now. would be cool. So, this is the game. And, wow, that glare. That's terrible. So, this is the game uh, back. This is actually the back side. And this is the front side. So, both sides. So, the good thing about the special edition, though, it comes with uh, both games in one cartridge. That is not possible any other way because um, each of the game is actually a separate cartridge uh, for the regular game if you were to buy it but uh for the special edition they put it all in one which is pretty cool and it's neat but what my friend said uh was like if they can put both of them in one why did they do two two different games but at the same time i don't care it's cool it's so cool so it makes it even a little bit more special because the cartridge itself will be like limited edition because there's no other cartridge like it you know like if you were to buy a regular version it's only that by itself um so it's super cool super cool i'm really really excited to play this game but okay that's uh the game uh i can open it up later when i am about to actually start playing we're gonna go look at the rest of the stuff so one thing that I was mostly excited about, I don't know if you guys want me to really show you a lot of the actual thingy, but this is uh, the book. Da -da -da. As you guys can see, the art. God, it's so beautiful. I don't even want to open it, really. I don't want to crease it too much, so I'm just going to keep it a little bit open. God. It looks so good. To be honest, this book itself would roughly cost, but on its own, if you probably go on eBay, I know people overprice it, but if I were to be legit like selling this, I would say um, this could easily sell for 20 to 30 bucks. Just the book. Just the book. Um, it, it has a lot of stuff. Um, they even put like some of the concept art, which is always really cool. If you like art or you're really a big fan this is like a must-have um, a lot of the character designs oh this is what I really like it's uh, all the fire emblems that are ever made which is pretty cool but unfortunately as the an American that we are or most of us are we didn't get the whole thing so it's cool anyway it's beautiful it's gorgeous um, also another fun thing about this I but this is from an actual another review it's like in the end of the book it gives you little notes because some of the, the concept art is written like little things are written in Japanese so you can find out uh, like the translation of what the designers were thinking or jotting down next to their sketches so super cool um I don't even know where to put it I'm so hype what is life um I guess we'll put it well, I don't like this side because I'm not Hoshiden. I am Team Nor.
So I'm gonna put this right here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Um. Okay. So that that's not it. We have one last thingy. Oh, I should keep put the box somewhere too. Um. For now, I'll just put it on my bed. But um. Uh, this. This. Uh. This is a cutie kind of thing. It's a little cloth that's made to hold your 3DS. So it's like a little 3DS holder. Uh, XL fits here and also, wow, what I really like right now is the detail. I mean, yeah, they could have added like little things here, but think about it. White, black, you know, Hoshido Noir. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Uh, the back side has another design, so you can check out the designs again. It's pretty cool. Very nice. And this one, very nice. Um, anybody here undecided on on what they want to or like? Like, are you guys anybody here like in the middle trying to decide like what to choose between Hoshido or Noir or? Are you guys all getting the special edition? Uh, if you need help or advice on which one to pick, um, you can just ask me right now. It's totally cool. I can... Um, oh, well, the 2DS is not going to fit on that. Uh, then again, why would you buy a 2DS? Uh, yeah, they could, like I said, there's certain things here that they could have done a little more. But for the price, because uh, what was the price? $70, $80, I believe. For the price, you're getting two games plus the code, so you get the third game. You're getting three games, technically, which is a lot of time, so you can play. Um, you, got, you got a good multiplayer mode that is not really, um, not really, I would say, difficult to decide. Uh, that what multiplayer is good for you or not because as a Fire Emblem fan you always kind of want to play with other people like you kind of want to because it's a strategy game but what's the best kind of strategies when you play against somebody it's like nobody wants to play chess by themselves right um, so it's really cool in that sense I will say it's absolutely worth it absolutely worth it now is it worth it Two hundred and fifty dollars worth it. Like the people that are reselling it on, I would say, well, mostly on eBay. That I will say it's worth it if you are a huge fan. Um, I've made a mistake before that I let things pass by and I just waited with time. Sometimes they'll make more. Sometimes they won't. And sometimes when they won't, the price would only go higher. So it's hard. You know, it's difficult. I would only say get the special edition if you really want to play all of the sides. You really like to be a collector. You really love the series. Then I would say get the special edition. Other than that, I think you could be okay with just either the Nor or um, Hoshido. It just you got to really choose the one you like. But it's kind of similar. Just know that Hoshido is more laid back and actually nor is more hardcore and hello i'm not hating